Hey guys, how are you? I'm your host, Benedict Guerrier. As always, it's a pleasure to have you guys tuning in for Real Estate Mondays. Today, we have a wholesale guru, Mr. Isaac. So please tell them what it is that you do. How you doing, guys? My name is Isaac Grace. I'm 25. I am a real estate wholesaling professional, where over the last six months, we've accumulated over $100,000 doing exactly that, wholesaling real estate properties. That's right. Listen, so every Monday is called the Action Mondays what it is that you want to do with your life to make it better. Tune in every Monday at 7.30 at 972 Broad Street, La Rouge Restaurant in Lyon. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about why we're doing this, to make sure that everybody gets their pockets laced. Benedict Gary is the owner of La Rouge Lounge. He's been doing this since the age of 26. We've been having this real estate meet up here for a year and a half, and we raised over $1.5 million by doing this event for free every Monday. So anything you need, we have it. If you need to get your credit restored, we have the connection for that. If you need to get funding, you get that as well. If you need to partner up with Ben, so that way you don't do it alone, that's what he's here for. So tonight we're gonna have our guest speaker, Isaac Grace. Topic is how to earn over 100,000 in six months by wholesaling real estate deals. He has been doing this for how long, I tell him. Four and a half years. In the last six months, he has raised over $150,000 in wholesale deals. So get your pen and paper together and welcome Ben Guerrier and Isaac Grace. consistently do these real estate Mondays. You know, sometimes I'm like, am I going to run out of things to say? But I know that the true purpose of this meetup is camaraderie. Some of us are seasoned, some of us are novice, some of us are just hungry, some of us just are riding the wave of the fad. Now let me tell you, real estate is near and dear to me because for me, it's, was that good? <laughs> That's like we had a comedy show. Um, the real estate is near and dear to me just because of how many lives that we truly affect by buying, selling property. Most people never have the opportunity to own a property, especially in urban communities, because it's just not taught. So I take this very serious, and I hope that you take this profession serious, too, because it's more than just making money. It's the mark that you leave on the planet and the neighborhoods and the lives that you change is the reason why we do these meetups. Keisha, you always short me. I started real estate when I was 23 years old because I was working for Warner Music Group and I was laid off because they had a merger with Viacom. And so from that moment, I said, I never want to give anybody that opportunity to dictate if I'm going to be able to feed my family or not. So with that, you know, I started doing odd things like buying and selling cars, uh, vacuuming people's uh, house through a company called R&D and Associates, but it, knew, it, it showed me that I was a door-to-door -door salesman, so I knew I had the approach to be able to gather people and, and rally them to make big purchases. So with that being said, you know, through a company called WLG World Leadership Group, I was able to learn about real estate and to come over here to New Jersey. I relocated back from California to purchase 91 properties, open up this restaurant, a vocational school and a car dealership and expand my real estate family to over 3,000 people now. So I definitely want to give us a round of applause too. <laughs> since we talked about numbers, within the first year, this small real estate group has raised $1.5 million. And that's just money that I've raised, let alone the deals that were done that I don't know about. You know, I have my insurance broker in here and he'll attest by coming to this meetup, he has closed several deals wholesalers, people that we partnered up with. Just today, I got two phone calls, investors that want to put up $100,000. 
So not only is this a real estate meetup for you to learn, but it's also a call of action Mondays. I don't just stand up here and say, hey, listen to me. I'm not selling anything. This is all free information. The only give back that I ask is you call me, you call my team, bring your deals to the table. We're constantly looking for properties to buy. We're constantly looking for contractors to hire, lawyers to hire, and anything, uh, anyone in between that to make the real estate happen. So with that, give a round of applause to my co host Mike Check. How's everybody doing today? Yeah. All right. Uh, my name is Isaac Grace. I'm 25 years old. Um, I've been in the real estate field when I since 20, like 20 and a half, so going on four and a half years now. Primarily, I'm doing wholesaling. Everyone knows what wholesaling is in here. Break it down. Break it down. Break it down. Okay, cool enough. So I've been in the wholesaling business for four and a half years. Um, I started in 2014 through the Jay Morrison Academy. Got my first deal in six months. I made $12,500, and ever since that day, I never looked back. It's been a lot of ups and downs, but being an entrepreneur, being a dream chaser, being a hustler is the best part of this lifestyle. So um, after about two and a half years of getting into the business, I finally had to wake up and not just figure out how to do a wholesale deal, but primarily how to run a wholesale business. Because we can, we can find a deal, but how can, we, how can we do it consistently so that we can feed our families, so that we can take care of our mom, our dad, and all of our dreams are wise. So before I really get into the wholesaling side of it, I want to tell you guys a little bit about my upbringing so you see where I came from to where I am. Um, I'm one of five kids. I'm the second oldest. Um, my mother moved down to Atlanta, Georgia when I was about 14 years, 13 years old. And I didn't want to go to Georgia, so I ended up staying out here in New Jersey. Um, I went through high school, I lived with my grandmother, a lot of ups and downs. And I actually, in my high school, dropped out. So uh, my grandmother kicked me out because I was just young, you know, like all of us, trying to stay out late. My grandmother wanted me in at 10 o'clock. We all know the party don't even start till 11, 11.30. So, you know, it was a lot of bump, bump in the head. She kicked me out, and um, I kind of found myself running the streets. Like a lot of us have been in this position, you know, running the streets, hustling, trying to make a couple dollars, trying to be able to take care of myself, impress people, women, all the things that come with the streets. And um, that's how I, I got a part of the, um, the Jay Morrison Academy. God willingly, I was able to get myself out of that and find something that was positive for me. So before I dig into the wholesaling, I wanted to put a, a couple quick exercises together for you guys just to show you that we all want to make the money, but in order to be successful and make the money, we got to have the right mindset. We got to understand the game that we're playing. This, this world is not designed for us in this room to win. It's not designed for us to win. So we have to figure out how can we overcome the oppression that's going on in today's world and stay level-headed and be able to get to this money. Now, so I didn't mean to cut you off, but that's a huge thing that he's saying. When he's saying us in this room, I know that they say if you, if you go to school, you graduate, you, you're guaranteed a good job. But with just how artificial intelligence is taking over jobs, a lot of people I know are graduating magna cum laude and are still struggling to get jobs. So a lot of times, big corporations pin the average blue-collar worker against each other so that way you're missing the opportunities that's out there. While all of this rhetoric, and a lot of it may be true or not true, that's going on in the news as far as federal government, state government, there's also a major redistribution of wealth that's happening right now. Mm -hmm. So while you're focusing on the racism and you're focusing on a lot of um, other issues, there also there's a major redistribution of wealth that's happening. And so I always want us to be conscious and um, open-minded about that. And because that's what makes us great about being Americans. You know, I'm Haitian, but I'm Haitian American. So to me, America is almost a brand. So you could be from anywhere in the world, but just having that American brand, you have that hustling spirit because only in this country can you make $12,000 in six months. I've been a lot of places, 
And twelve thousand dollars in six months is not something that you can do. Okay. So I always want us to be open minded about that as we are looking to get richer. You know, it's the social impact that we leave on our planet for the generation to come that is truly important. All right, great, great, great. So I just want to let you guys know I'm I'm honored to be here today. All these beautiful faces here, all my kings, all my queens. And when I first thought about my why from when I went out and invested a lot of money into mentors, everyone here is, what's your why? You know, why are you doing this? And I had many whys. You know, family, you know, the finer life, vacation, traveling, doing what I wanted. But one of my biggest whys was doing exactly what I'm doing right here. Giving the game back to everybody that are less fortunate or everyone's past is different. I was able to maneuver through this world and find the right people so that I can connect the dots and be successful in a business like real estate. We all know real estate is one of the most successful businesses where a lot of millionaires um, use this to, as a vehicle to generate wealth. So I want to do these quick um, mind hacks for you guys before we talk about the nitty gritty fun stuff, just so you guys understand how important it is to take life serious today. So I don't need this mic. Everybody can hear me? Yeah. All right. So this cool hack right here, everyone grab a pencil, put a calculator. You don't need a calculator because I want everyone to calculate their own personal selves. So 